we're hucksters in a of reckoning on our campus and as a country reckoning in the next six months we are, we are going to decide what kind of country we are going to be right and this was before uh shit popped off with the goddamn or was this what, oh this was summer of love wasn't it this is like a year ago in 20 years give or take five or so on the front or the back this is going to be a majority minority country Ooh. we can do it the um way where it's the truth justice and freedom under the law or we can do it the ugly way and uh. part of these protests i think we she's threatening a she's like threatening in addition to all the violence that's been occur in incurring and she's just able to do that <laughs> like she's just able to fucking do that like this mouth breathing like dead eyed low IQ just gaze like we can do it just the hallway mm -hmm. like this is what universities are paying um and it's gratifying for to see these protests um because it, mostly it's peaceful at that a, a forcing a reckoning that I've certainly never seen in my lifetime I've been teaching for 20 years um on these topics I've been thinking about them for a lifetime and so, um, and what I'm thinking, at least my, my rough uh, observation, is that a lot of protesters are under the age of 35. So this is a generational movement in many respects, particularly the multicultural parts of it. And so um, someone was just asking this question. I've been trying to answer. So she just basically said, yeah, this is a reckoning that's been coming um, up, the, up the pipe because she's been talking about it, teaching about it. And they t said at the beginning of this video, that they've been in, want, trying to incentivize people in the institutions of higher learning to be um, anti-racist educators to like give them promotions and money and stuff. So this is just them telling you that they want to shake you down for cash so that they can continue rioting and, for black power so that they could just seize property from you via violence. And they're using the university system in order to indoctrinate foot soldiers to do this and they're they're just telling this straight up to you and this only has like 900 views conservative media doesn't care about it they don't care like they're gonna call this like bigotry of low expectations and mlk is rolling over in his grave or some such nonsense like that no he's 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 yippy skippying dude I'm a, as an educator i want to fill that cup yeah, if you want to see chalice. this campus be an anti-racist campus, you need anti -white to write campus. our campus leaders, write op-eds in the Diamondback, write the legislators, write the um, the Board of Governors, they call them the Board of Chancellors, the Board of every state university has a board that manages the operations for the university system of Maryland. Find those people, find the contact information, figure out how to get on the agenda and tell them that this is the kind of campus you want the University of Maryland to be. Revolting. That, those are my recommendations. Write your legislature, state and federal. So you want more rioting and more twerking on top of ambulances? Right. Disgusting. Um.